what is special, and I'm still, every time that I perform, I'm surprised, is that no matter where we are, no matter what kind of culture is, like in, in, in the city we are performing, somehow, at the end of the show, everyone is always very happy. Maybe in the beginning, like some people laugh and react right from the beginning. We have a short announcement, it's funny too, and sometimes people clap just for the announcement. Some other times you have to wait until we halfway through Swan Lake or Sophie, depending on what the opening valley is, to see people react. You need to love classical ballet in any way you want to like it, but you need to love it. Because you like classical ballet, because you like to dance, it's not always the same thing, but you want to love it, so you want to make a parody of something you know. You want you, you need knowledge of classical ballet. So dance skills, and then you want to also laugh with about yourself with the audience with ballet, not about oh, laugh at ballet, but with ballet to all together, we want to laugh together. So I don't want to be ashamed of being a little ridiculous sometimes. I just want to feel free, and if I have to go against the rule of classical ballet to make people laugh, that's acceptable. Sometimes that's hard to understand if you're a dancer, if you're a dancer, you want to do exactly your classical training at its best, you want to be the best dancer you can be. Sometimes you just have to go against that, and I'm free to do it, because it's for the show. And it's a show for everybody. Kids are welcome. Every kind of person actually is going to enjoy it. If you like ballet, you're more than welcome, you're going to like it. If you don't like ballet, you'll find a way to like the show because we are laughing with ballet also. So they are going to like it. So I think that this is pretty for everyone. Don't be scared.